this is tomorrow, signing off with some more Monster Hunter World. Alright, last time I just demonstrated a basic hunt with a very weak monster compared to what I got. So, but what to do now? I think I'm going to take an optional mission. Something I haven't done yet. It's two stars, so it's pretty going to be probably pretty simple and pretty boring, but let's clear it out. Snatch a snatcher, we got to catch a cool... A Kulu Yaku. Kulu Yaku. And... Little weird wormy thing. Well, not wormy, but... Anyways, we gotta capture it. So this is a good way to demonstrate how to capture monsters. I don't think we need any food right now, so let's just depart on the quest. Come on. So we're now we're going to capture this thing. We just got to weaken it, get it limping, and then set a trap, set some smoke bombs. Well, drink bombs. And it's ours. It's actually pretty simple and actually really fun in a way. It's going, it's going. Give it a minute. There we go. Depart now. Depart now. I'm not going to wait for people to join the team. I'll just send it out an SOS flare as we start. If people want to get in. And so yeah, this time we're using the Insect Glaive, which is like my second favorite weapon so far. Alright. Use our shortcuts. SOS Flare so someone can join the fight if they want. It's really nice, you got these shortcuts, radial wheels, so you can set your emotes and everything. Shortcuts for items. I should do an a shortcut for this or er, second wheel ammo coatings. I gotta use more uh, Gun types or at least give them a try. All right So I'm not gonna waste time this time around and we're just gonna go look for this thing Collecting herbs along the way Woo! Oop. A Kulu Yaku's broken egg and we already got enough information to hunt this thing down. Oh, I think I see it. Right next to a Barath? Oh, sleep, Herb. I need more of those. Oh. Yep, there it is. Is it fighting a Barath? Yeah, it's fighting a Barath already. So that little skinny raptor thing is what we're after. Oh, guess they're not fighting. They're just talking, I suppose, or something. And next to it is the big hulking Barith. It's a really cool rock monster. Let's get on top. Whoop. Okay. Things getting away. I don't want to start a fight with both of these things. Are these two, two things fighting or not? I suppose not. He just disappeared. Okay, now it's just me and you, Kukaloo. I am taking you down. You hear me? You're going down! I'm gonna shoot you in the face. Aha! The fight begins! Now the insect glaive is kind of weird because it's this really agile weapon, but it's also got a kit, something called a kinsect attached to it. And a little flying insect that has different element properties. It's an upgradable weapon along with the, uh, the insect glaive. But, uh, here comes the Barath again. But you can upgrade a kinsect so it can have different elemental properties and can do different things. Like, if I get, you can mark a target, and if you hit the mark enough times with the blade, they activate different element effects or even a different passive ability, which in my case, it's got fire attached to it. 
and if I get enough hits, I got a chance to paralyze it. Also, we can do this. Yeah. Just love flying around with this thing. Uh-oh, come on. There we go, I mounted him. And also with the insect blade, when you mount a creature and move around, you can just slash at it, slash away at it. Oop. That was a quick mount. Uh, that sounds awful. Okay. Oh, and uh, there's a little uh, bar underneath my weapon sharpness that depending on how much the Kinsect does, it can get different ability, or it can basically hold on to passive buffs, and then when I call him back, I can get those buffs from attack damage, a health boost, etc. This seems pretty... I hope I don't kill this thing in its first go. Because I gotta capture him. No, it's not limping yet, so still pretty resilient. Alright, I had a piercing pod. Or is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, it's limping. So, with that being said, we're gonna get the pitfall trap ready. There's a mining outcrop. Where is it? It's going to try and heal. I want to get the mining outcrop real quick. Just hold on. I know what I'm doing. He won't heal too much. He's trying to eat in order to heal, but he won't heal too much because I'm going to put this down. He's going to get sucked into the ground. Boom! Boom! Two drink bombs and you're down. Aha! All right, we caught this thing. Simple as that. That was a pretty quick mission, so we're not going to go yet. We're going to head back to camp, and we'll just take on another mission. That's why I'm glad. When you capture a monster, you get less time. You get 20 seconds before you go back to camp, as opposed to 60 when you kill it. So that's why I went to the mining outcrop first, just to get it, because I knew I wouldn't have enough time. All right, we get quite a lot of rewards for that, actually. It's a simple hunt, but it's a rewarding hunt. That's the thing about this, is that I feel like if you come back to this after like a couple months of not playing it, there's not only going to be so much more added into it, but even doing simple hunts to get like get yourself back into it, you're still going to get quite a good amount of rewards uh, for doing them. So yeah, we're back to camp. Let's talk to Handler. We're on the hunt. Yes, we are. And post a new quest. Is there a new optional mission? Nope. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, we could go to the arena, but I don't want to do that right now. There's arena missions for capturing monsters, but... Uh, I don't want to do that yet. And maybe we'll do another hunt. What else can we do? Oh, you know what? Where is... There's got to be one here. Okay, just checking for another one. But yeah, let's go hunt a Barith. Since we saw one of those, let's hunt it. Hunt it. Bleh, sorry. Quest accepted. Depart right away. We're gonna go after that rock monster we saw, uh, arguing with the kookaloo. Kuk 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 I just want to call it a kookaloo just for simplicity's sake. All right, we only got 15 minutes for this. Okay, I better hurry up. But I just wanted to go item box quickly. Nope. Get rid of. All the stuff I don't need. Hmm. 
then restock on... Oh, I'm out of Trank Bombs. I only got those two left, I think. Shoot. Get a Pitfall Trap and a Electric Trap. And I'm out of Trank Bombs, so I gotta make these two count. Because I'll see how I feel. Maybe I want to capture this thing just for the bonus rewards. But we better hurry. Actually, we're gonna set up an SOS Flare just in case. Some missions you can or can't use an SOS Flare, but I just do it just because. Never know, someone can jump in and just have a good time. The bear shouldn't be too far. Should be somewhere around here. Hey, guys! Not sure, are the scout flies leading me to him right away, or... Well, I've got faith in the scout flies. Ooh. Wiggly Lich -tea. Unlimited stamina for a while. There he is. has begun. Ah, shoot. Waterlogged. Ah, dang. Did he just knock himself out? No, not quite. Hitting all the armor parts on him. This already isn't going too well. No, get out of there! I thought this would be simple. Oh, I'm stunned already! Oh yeah, my po insect glaive also has a poison element attached to it. There we go. over him, but he's pretty big, so maybe I shouldn't have thought so. There we go, got on top of his head. Oh, what? Oh, there we go. The cat's got him trapped. There are certain special things you can do, so now they got the vine trap on him. I got a bunch of little palcos helping out. I mounted him, but then he smashed me into the wall by hitting his head, so I need to move out of the way. right away while he's trapped. Probably could have gotten more out of it. Okay, he's taken off. Still got quite a bit of health, it seems. Dung beetle? Oh, oh I should have dashed and then... Where's the mining outcrop? Is it up there? I think I walked past it. Darn it. Oh well. Got 10 minutes left. This is a little t short time limit for this, but it's doable. Surprise! Oh, not so much a surprise. He turned around.
Go, he's limping. We already almost got him. I'm gonna get you. He's limping. Now we just gotta set a trap. A trap. I think there's a way to do it without having any traps if you don't have any, but it's easier that way. Whoop! I wanna trap him instead of killing him right away. Woo! Woo! Ah, oh, I love that. Oh, there's a mining outcrop nearby. Where is it? Did I pass it up again? Was it in that pit? Oh, well. But yeah, that's why I love the insect lake when you can make jumps like that. Let's do the shock trap. Oh, you fell into it. There we go. Got him. Sweet. Whoop, not in there. Nitro shroom. Well, what are you doing here? Get out of here! Alright, so we got... We cop two creatures this time around. We got a Barith and one of those Kukaloos. You know, I'm just gonna keep calling them that if they're gonna make those weird names. Just more fun to say. So yeah, not simple missions, but still fun. Oh, I think this is the lo er, largest Barath I've got, according to that. So yeah, just a little cap capture. And now, since they're captured, they're going to be released into the arena, where I can slaughter them again. Ah, uh -huh. <sighs> no, sorry. But yeah, good start, good start. Uh, so yeah. Hello. Talk to them real quick. We hunt two large monsters. We got an armor spear plus. Register new bounties. Yeah, I suppose. Oh hey, there's a exclamation point over here. What's up with this person? Oh. Bareth, look at him, this little sweepy thing. Hello. I must thank you for capturing the Kuk Kulu Yaku. Oh, right, this was part of a different mission. 500 research points. Yay. Good to see you. Splendid, the fifth fleet. Just who I was looking for. Present, we ogres studying, or studying the bear's behavior. Oh. Good luck. I already captured a Barith. Does that one not count? I suppose since I wasn't doing it in the right mission. All right, fine. I completely forgot about that guy. That's what the Kulu mission was for. So now I gotta capture another Barith. There's one right there, guys. Come on. Oh, well. No problem. I just gotta craft more stuff. More Trank Bombs. Just make a bunch as much as I can. Need more sleep herbs and perish rooms. And I need more nets and trap tools. Actually, that's not too hard. Oh, I need ivy for nets. Dang it. I got a couple more traps, but I'm about to run out, so I gotta make more. Hey. Can this guy grow ivy? I'm harvesting. I always harvest too early. I could wait. Ah, no ivy. No sleep herbs either. I wonder if there's a way to do that. Alright, keep fertilizing parish rooms. 
Oh. All right. So, I suppose that's about it. That's about it for now. Next time, we'll see what we do. Maybe we'll go capture another Barrett or do something else. But until then, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe and all that. This is Tamara, signing off.